Hi, I'm Paul from P23 Productions, and today's video is in a little bit different setting. I'm outdoors mostly. I'll be inside for a couple examples. But the purpose of today's video is to test out DX Revive. They just updated the plugin here in February of 2024, depending on when you're watching this video. And we want to see how much better the plugin has uh, gotten. I'm going to purposely be recording bad audio, so uh, don't think I'm some sort of uh, non-professional. I, I know how to record good audio, and this plugin is not a substitute for not using professional equipment. I uh, just want to make that clear. Um, the examples I'm going to be setting up today is um, I'm going to be checking out how it handles reverb or echo inside. Um, we're going to be uh, walking down the street and checking out how it handles noise. And the third one that I'm gonna to try to set up is uh, clipping or distortion. So for that, I'll probably use like a lavalier mic and set the levels higher than they should be. And uh, we'll see the results of that. Now, again, this audio is recorded poorly on purpose. And uh, this is not a substitute for not using proper professional equipment, but um, things happen in production. And sometimes a microphone gets disconnected or a setting gets thrown off and we need to recover audio and fix it um, because there's no other alternative. Sometimes uh, you can get away with ADR, but um, that's not always the case. So we're gonna see if DX Revive can come to the rescue. Let's check it out. Okay, so in this first example, I'm in an area that has high ceilings. You could probably hear the AC running, which makes a lot of noise. Also, I'm at a good distance from the phone. And the only thing that's picking up my audio is the microphone from the phone. I don't have any type of labs or anything like that. So we're listening to see what the plugin can do and how we can recover the audio that is only being recorded on the phone. All right, so here in my second example, I just wanted to take a stroll out in the neighborhood using a different camera. Obviously this is a gimbal camera. Um, I actually wanted to talk about the compatibility of this plugin. The great thing about this plugin is that it can work in anything that is AAX, BST, or audio components if you're using Mac. Um, I've been able to use this plugin on Adobe Premiere, Final Cut, DaVinci Resolve, even Avid Media Composer, and audio editing apps such as Adobe Audition, uh, Twisted Wave, and I'm sure some of the other ones, um, uh, Logic is another one that I've used. So this um, plugin is gonna work for you pretty much in any DAW or post-production, uh, video post-production software. All right, so here we are in our third example. We went out and got a professional mic system. It has the lavalier, the transmitter, the receiver, and in this transmitter, you can record just not 32-bit float, so you gotta have your audio set correctly. Now, I'm about to start speaking loud, because what if somebody all of a sudden starts speaking really loud after you have your level set, and now your audio becomes unusable? You can't get to the settings quick enough. Oh no, what do we do? Well, let's head over to post-production and see if DX Revive can fix this problem. All right, so sorry if some of my examples were a little bit ridiculous and over the top, but um, I just wanted to push my examples to the extreme. Now, remember, I wasn't plugged into any microphones with the exception of the clipping example. I think the results that the plugin gave us was uh, good results. I don't think I have a better plugin right now in my arsenal to deal with audio issues. Um, sometimes there are certain plugins that are specific to certain issues that you might want to default to um, when having those audio issues, but I think DX Revive is a great plugin to have. I think it solves a lot of problems with one plugin and one knob that you can turn. Um, I would go to FX Factory right now, I would download the trial, check it out record some of your bad audio and just you know do your own tests and i don't think the results are going to disappoint you so um check it out and um nothing else i could tell you except for it's a great plugin so um thank you fx factory and uh accentize for creating this plugin and i hope you guys like this video check out the trial